Denmark boasts some of the most advanced military machines in the world, but are they worth it? What are the strongest military vehicles in their arsenal? And can they compete against some of the most powerful forces in the world? Well, in this video, you'll find out as we showcase the top 10 most powerful military vehicles of the Royal Danish Army. In this list, we'll include only land vehicles, leaving warships and aircrafts for future contents. But before we start this exciting journey, what country should be next? Let us know in the comment. And don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see much more military rankings. And now let's dive deep into the military world, exploring the 10th machine in our list. Number 10, Supercat HMT-400. The Supercat, known as the Jackal in some military services, is a highly mobile, multi-role vehicle currently used by the Danish Armed Forces for reconnaissance and rapid response missions. This vehicle is manufactured in the United Kingdom by Supercat, designed to perform reliably on challenging terrain with a 4x4 drive. Its robust diesel engine produces around 180 horsepower, allowing it to reach the speeds up to 120 km per hour. The HMT-400 has a gross weight of approximately 9 metric tons, supporting a payload of up to 2.5 metric tons, which can be adapted depending on mission needs. For crew safety, the vehicle includes modular armor that can be adjusted to offer protection against ballistic threats and mine blasts. The HMT-400 can mount various armament configurations, typically including general purpose and heavy machine guns, ensuring versatility in combat roles. Number 9. M113G4DK The M113G4DK is an advanced version of the classic M113 armored personnel carrier modified for Danish Army standards. Built by the United States and upgraded in Denmark, the G4DK enhances mobility, protection, and firepower for soldiers in combat. Weighing around 13 metric tons, it's equipped with a 7.62 mm machine gun and additional armor for improved survivability. Powered by a diesel engine, this vehicle supports a top speed of over 60 km per hour, offering the Danish forces a robust, versatile platform for a variety of mission profiles. Number 8 AM General HMMW V Yulcat The Yulcat used by the Danish military is a modified version of the standard HMMWV. It was initially equipped with the TOW missile system under the model designation M1045, but was later adapted as a patrol vehicle after the TOW system was phased out. Known as Yulcot, this vehicle was repurposed primarily for reconnaissance and patrol roles. It retained some of the Humvee's rugged characteristics and had adaptations to support a 12.7mm heavy machine gun in later configurations. Another notable derivative in Danish service, the Moag Eagle Y, also used the HMMW V chassis, but with Swiss-designed armored modifications for increased protection against small arms and grenade fragments. Both vehicles served extensively in various Danish operations until the late 2000s. Number 7. Mastiff 3. The Mastiff 3 is a heavily armored, six-wheeled protected patrol vehicle designed for transporting troops safely through dangerous terrains, especially for missions like road patrols and convoy protection. As the third variant in the Mastiff line, it can carry eight passengers along with two crew members. It's well-suited for high-threat areas, notably in the Middle East and Afghanistan, where it's used to protect against small arms fire, improvised explosive devices, and other roadside hazards. Equipped with advanced weaponry, the Mastiff III can mount a 7.62mm general-purpose machine gun, a .50 caliber heavy machine gun, or a 40mm automatic grenade launcher. This flexibility makes it highly adaptable to various mission requirements. Additionally, it includes features like the Bowman radio system and electronic countermeasures, enhancing communication and defense against electronic threats. Number 6. Moag Piranha 2C The Piranha 2C is an eight-wheeled armored personnel carrier used by the Danish Army. Built by the Swiss company Moag, now part of General Dynamics European Land Systems, 
It is well regarded for its adaptability and reliability. Denmark acquired the Piranha 3C as part of its modernization efforts, ordering more than 100 units to enhance its mechanized infantry's mobility and protection. This APC is powered by a high-performance diesel engine, generating around 400 horsepower, enabling it to reach a maximum speed of approximately 100 kilometers per hour on roads. Weighing around 22 metric tons when fully equipped, the Piranha APC is designed for both durability and tactical mobility. It is armed primarily with a remote-controlled weapon station, often mounting a heavy 12.7mm machine gun with options for secondary armaments, such as grenade launchers. Number 5. Moag Piranha V. The Piranha V is a highly versatile eight-wheeled armored personnel carrier produced by General Dynamics European Land Systems. It plays a critical role in the Danish Army, with 309 units ordered across multiple configurations, including infantry, command, ambulance, and engineering support. This armored vehicle stands out for its adaptable design, capable of providing substantial protection against ballistic, mine, and improvised explosive device threats. The Piranha 5 has a combat weight of approximately 33 metric tons, and is powered by a Scania engine delivering up to 724 horsepower, allowing it to reach a top speed of around 100 kilometers per hour on road. Equipped with modular armor, the vehicle's protection levels can be adjusted based on mission requirements. Depending on the configuration, it can be armed with a variety of weapons, including a remotely operated 12.7 mm heavy machine gun or a 30 mm automatic cannon. Number 4. Elbit Systems PULs The Elbit Systems Precise and Universal Launching System is a modern Israeli-made multiple launch rocket system now in use by the Danish Army. Mounted on a Tatra 815-746x6 truck, this advanced artillery system is capable of launching various munitions, including guided rockets with ranges of up to 150 kilometers. The PULS can carry and fire two types of pods simultaneously, accommodating diverse munitions for enhanced operational flexibility. Denmark chose the PULs to replace its Caesar howitzers, which were donated to Ukraine, and aims for the system to be fully operational by 2025. Danish forces recently conducted test firings at the Oxbow range, highlighting the system's power and effective integration with local military units. Number 3. Elbit Systems Atmos 2000 the Elbit Systems Atmos 2000 is a powerful self-propelled howitzer chosen by the Danish Army to enhance its long-range artillery capabilities. This Israeli-designed system, built on an eight-wheeled truck chassis, is a highly mobile platform designed for rapid deployment and effective fire support. Its main armament is a 155mm, 52 caliber gun, compatible with NATO standard munitions. The Atmos 2000 can achieve firing ranges over 40 kilometers using standard rounds, with extended reach using rocket-assisted projectiles. Denmark began integrating the Atmos 2000 under a contract signed with Elbit Systems in 2023, with deliveries ongoing and completion expected in the coming years. This modular artillery piece is engineered to operate in a variety of terrains and boasts advanced fire control systems ensuring both precision and efficiency. Number 2.09035 DK Mark III. The CV9035 DK Mark III is an advanced infantry fighting vehicle used by the Danish Army, produced by BAE Systems Heglens in Sweden. Denmark initially ordered 44 units of the CV9035 series in 2005, which were delivered between 2008 and 2010. This variant is equipped with a 35mm Bushmaster, three automatic cannon, capable of firing airburst munitions, making it effective against both ground and aerial targets. For added firepower, it has a 7.62mm coaxial machine gun and supports programmable ammunition that improves targeting precision. In terms of protection, the CV9035DK integrates modular armor and can mount additional layers, including MEXAS and AMAP armor for enhanced defense. It is also fitted with a soft kill active protection system to counter threats like guided missiles. 
Powered by a Scania DS16 engine, delivering over 610 horsepower, this vehicle reaches speeds of up to 70 kilometers per hour and has a range of approximately 600 kilometers. Number 1. Leopard 2 A7DK The Leopard 2 A7DK is Denmark's advanced variant of the Leopard 2 series, produced by the German companies Krauss Maffei Wegmann and Rheinmetall. Originally based on the Leopard 2 A5DK, the Danish Army upgraded 44 of its units to the Leopard 2 A7DK standard to boost their combat performance and survivability. Weighing around 68 metric tons, this model includes a more powerful Rheinmetall L55 smoothbore gun, capable of firing advanced programmable rounds and high-penetration Sabbat rounds. Enhanced protection features include updated armor that withstands ballistic threats and blasts from mines and improvised explosive devices. For greater crew safety, it incorporates a state-of-the-art fire control system, new thermal optics, and a mobile camouflage solution. The tank's powertrain features a robust diesel engine that offers substantial mobility across challenging terrains, supported by an upgraded suspension system to handle the added weight. As we conclude our exploration of the top 10 most powerful military vehicles of the Royal Danish Army, we hope you've been inspired by the strength of these impressive machines. Do you agree with this list? Write it down in the comment below. And don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see much more rankings like this.